Central with another new video and here today we're talking about Duke women's basketball and their three commits for the class of 2022. Obviously Carol Lawson and the Duke women's basketball program still doing a lot of recruiting here in 2022 and still a lot of targets that they have left on their board but we're going to talk about the three players that they have verbally committed for this class of 2022 starting with the 19th ranked player in the ESPNW rankings for the class of 2022 and that is Shea Bolin. Six foot three forward ranked in 19th overall and sixth at her position. Really good face up for prospects. She has the ability to go inside and play outside. Very, very up tempo type of player has that style and uh, really is going to fit what Carol Lawson wants to do. Obviously, you know, we haven't been able to see Duke this season. Uh, we'll see them next season, really see the identity uh, that they're going to have under Carol Lawson. This is going to be a tough team, a physical team. Uh, they're going to be smart. And uh, Shea Bowen really checks all of those boxes with the ability to go inside and outside offensively, rebound, clean the glass, and, and play defense. Really perfect fit for Duke, as is Ashlyn Jackson, ranked 22nd overall in the ESPNW rankings and second at her position at the guard spot. Five foot ten, really quick, versatile backcourt player, rebounds well, pushes the tempo in the open floor. Good half court player, really creative, can score uh, from beyond the arc, can drive inside. This is a very complete player. And just to put in perspective how good of a player she is, you know, UConn was really recruiting her hard. You, know, you look at Texas. Uh, Baylor, so many other schools were recruiting her and really wanted her, uh, but the fact that she's committed to Duke and wants to be a part of uh, the culture at Duke, which I think is, is going to be a really big deal, uh, is huge, huge for Carol Lawson. Uh, again, uh, Ashlyn Jackson, really, uh, to me, the prize piece of the class so far, and I think uh, will end up being uh, a great player for the Blue Devils. So those two, a lot of people know know plenty about uh, with Bolin and, and, and Jackson but the third commit is Emma Kobo, uh, Colborne native and uh, really really good player uh, really skilled player uh, when you look at her recruitment it was very it was very foggy um, it wasn't as active she had talked to James Madison in Iowa State uh, back in September of 2020 um, when uh, coaches could not contact her but then when Carol Austin called um, it was an instant connection. Those two uh, really, really hit it off well, and uh, she ended up committing to Duke. I think this is a player that uh, will also be very big for them in the future, and uh, when you look at her skill set and uh, what she's able to do, uh, it's just it's just really, really, really exciting. She's out of Canada and uh, possesses so many different abilities offensively and defensively, and uh, I think Carol Lawson is going to get uh, a lot out of her as well. Uh, when you look at her ability to shoot inside and outside uh, with her ability defensively the, the potential there at the guard spot it's just it's just very exciting so again these are the three commits for duke women's basketball in the class of 2022 so far ashlyn jackson shea bolin and emma Koba. for more information on duke women's basketball and anything hoops check out hoops central on facebook twitter and youtube